Hey, what's going on YouTube? Jen Did Commando here, and today we're going to be reacting to, I can't even pronounce it, but it's basically Finland and how they would react in a certain situation um, regarding war, and it looks really good. I've had a brief 20, 30 seconds look at it, and there is subtitles on here as well, guys. So this is a, a video for um, our Finnish brothers and sisters recommended by a Swedish person, actually. So this is off the back of a very, very successful Jäger Soldat series that we reacted to. We're going to be starting reacting to a few more Finland videos now and a few more Sweden videos on top of that, guys. So this is our first video outside of the, Swin uh, the Sweden videos. I really do hope you enjoy it, troops. It's going to be a real good one. I'm looking forward to reacting to it. It's something different as well. So hopefully we've got all of our Sweden brother and sisters here because you guys have been fantastic support. And this content isn't too far away from your content, I hope. So, yeah. Before we get in, please smash that like button. Please subscribe to the channel if you haven't subscribed already. And join the Discord, okay? The Discord link is in the description, troops. So you can have a bit of a chat with me and all of the members in the, in the community there. We've got some fantastic people on, on board there. Loads of military guys and girls. Loads of ex-servant, uh, veterans. You name it, they're all on there. And a little bit about myself then to the Finland uh, community. I'm a former Royal Marines commando. Um, I served in the British Armed Forces. And the Royal Marines are considered, you know, one of the best military outfits in the world as well. So I'm um, very fortunate to have earned the Green Beret. And yeah, I really look forward to chatting with you all. And hopefully we get a new cohort of subscribers in the meantime. But let's just get straight into it then, troops, yeah? Cool. Suomi on varautunut puolustamaan itseään erilaisissa sotilaissa kriiseissä. Viimeaikaiset kokemukset kriiseistä lähialueellamme ovat saaneet myös meidät muuttamaan ajatustamme puolustuksesta. Hyökkäys voi alkaa monella tavalla. So I think they're simulating something on this one. Um, that's what I think anyway, different situations and stuff and how they respond. Helsingin alueella laajat tietoliikennehäiriöt ovat pysäyttäneet junaliikenteen ja ovat ruuhkauttaneet keskustaan tulevan ajoneuvoliikenteen. Kansaneläkelaitoksella on vakavia tietoliikennehäiriöitä. Maksuliikenne eläkkeiden ja työttömyyskorvauksien osalta on pysähdyksissä. Tilannekatsaus jatkuu Puoshaarojen katsauksilla. Maavoimat, olkaa hyvä. Lappeenrannan alueella juomavesi on saastunutta ja sabotaasia epäillään. Maankuntakomppania on perustamassa juomaveden jakelupaikkoja Lappeen rantaan. Lovisan ydinvoimala on vaaratilanteen välttämiseksi ajettu alas hallitusti. Uudella maalla olevan laajan sähkökatkoksen takia pankit ja tavaratalot ovat joutuneet poistamaan asiakkaat tilanteen. So I think they shown how they would initially initiate all of the close down procedures to prevent um, catastrophic failures and damages guys. Sotilaallinen jännitys Itämerellä on edelleen lisääntynyt. Naton mukana toiminnan aggressiivisuus vaarantaa alueen siviiliilmailun sekä merenkulun turvallisuutta. Useita läheltä piti tilanteita pidetään tahallisina tekoina. Puolustusvoimat tehostaa turvatoimiaan kaikissa joukko-osastoissa. Aji, siellä on matalalla tunnistamaton ilmailu Helsingin eteläpuolella. Ok, Laijani, tunnistustehtävä maali Helsingin eteläpuolella matalalla. Please drop a chat in uh, in the live feed. What does what does that even say? If someone can translate that for me, that would be great. We need a new translator for the channel. We now need someone from Finland. So if we've got any volunteers, please please get in contact with us. Okay. I think that means battlefield. Tehostetussa valmiudessa turvallisuustaso Bravo Plus. Ulsvoimat mediassa. Ulsministeriön viestintäjohtaja kertoo, että rajavartiolaitos tutkii kaikkia viittä epäiltyä ilmatilan loukkausta, mutta ei tiedota asiasta enempää, koska tutkinta on kesken. Tilannekatsaus jatkuu puoshaarojen katsauksilla. Maavoimat, olkaa hyvä. Maavoimat. Joukko-osastot ovat käskeneet sitoumuksen antaneet välittömän valmiuden joukot kertausharjoituksiin. Kertausharjoitusten enimmä... Right, so at this moment it looks like they've obviously closed everything down and they're now getting all their reservists, uh, their trained soldiers who are reservists back into um, a capacity where they can be actively um, employed again, you know. So it's a it's a good thing. I think most countries would do that, yeah. They get the, the reservists straight into action so they can bolster the numbers of guys. ...mäs vuorokausimäärää on kasvatettu. Kohteiden suojaaminen on käsketty aloittaa suunnitelman mukaisesti. Paikallisjoukkoja on kutsuttu vapaaehtoja. Okay, what's, uh, what's that beret then? What, 
what soldiers are these? Because I've never seen these before. If someone could let me know in the chat who these guys are, I'd be uh, interested to find out. Sen harjoitukseen Hangon alueelle. Valmis osa linnoitteiden rakentaminen on aloitettu sopimuskumppanien kanssa. Maa voivat päättää. Merivoimat. Puolivoiman edustalla on tehty sukellusvenen havainto. Valmiusalukset on käsketty sukellusvenen torjuntaan. Merimiinnyttämisen valmistelut on käsketty rannikkolaivastolle. Kauppameren kulun suojaamista on tehostettu kriittisten kuljetusten osalta. Merivoimat jatkaa yhteistoimintaharjoitusta Ruotsin kanssa Itämerellä. Merivoimat päättää. Ilmavoimat. Lentokalusto on hajautettu tukikohtiin. Taistelutukikohdan harjoitus Viermäen varalaskupaikalla on toimeenpantu. Ilma... Yeah, so they're getting all the military counterparts uh, prepped and ready to go. Looks like they've still got um, all of the naval um, born ships and stuff um, doing the normal work, except they're laying uh, sea mines and stuff like that in order to stop any potential threats. So it's um, it's 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 how they're kind of prepping for um, for for war really. Ilmavalvonta on tehostettu ja valmius ilmaoperaatioiden toimeenpano on välitön. Ilmavoimat päättää. Merivoimat on paikattanut sukellusveneen Porvoon edustalla ja varoittanut sitä käsisyvyyspommilla. Puolustusvoimat on nostanut valmiuttaan ja useita kymmeniä harjoitu. So these exercises I'd imagine would be to get the reservists up to scratch again because obviously they're not full time soldiers and it would be in preparation and readiness to um, defend its country guys all right so yeah, I'd imagine they'd be going through all of the weapons, um, getting used to them again, firing them, test firing them, seeing if all of the kit is serviceable and ready. Tuksia on meneillään eri paikkakunnilla. Lisäksi puolustusvoimat on kutsunut lisää... Exactly what we said, guys, refreshing. ...reserviläisiä kertausharjoituksiin. Tilanne on poikkeuksellinen. Onko tässä nähtävissä uhkaa? No kyllä tilanne on tällä hetkellä uhkaava. Suomi on tällä hetkellä aggressiivisen vaikuttamisen kohteena. Tämä vaikuttaminen on monialaista. Mihin meidän täytyy nyt varautua? No, tällä hetkellä viranomaiset varautuu niihin mahdollisiin kehityskulkuihin. Ei tässä kansalaiset tarvitse huolissaan olla. Ilmaoperaatiokeskus Kuulolla. Mahdollinen ohjusisku sieltä mereltä ja suuntautuu kohti Viermaa ja Kuopiota. Tuk Things heating up now guys. Looks like there's a potential um, missile attack now. So let's see how they respond. Tukeutumisukseerit. Hälyttäkää tukikohdat ja konekalusta ilmaa. Okay. Tuleeko Vierma tässä tukeutumisukseen? Ohjus isku mereltä kohti tukikohtaa. Ilma hälytys. Isot parvi ilmaan. Suunta 360 johtaa paiskaa oikein. Vuoropäällikkö Viermälle osunut. Vauriot tukeutumiskykyyn liittyen selvityksessä mahdollisesti henkilöstötappioita. Useita haavoittuneita. Tukikohdassa oleva Hornet-parvi käskytettiin ilman ajoissa. Nostakaa turvallistoso Deltaa ja pitäkää p tike tietoisaa tilanteen kehityksestä. Vuoropäällikkö, lentosuunnitelman reisiltä poikkeava siviilikonekohdan hätäkoodia vähentää lentokorkeutta kohti Kajaani. Skyline 267 will land runway 25. After landing, taxi to Abram. Kajaanin lennon varmistus. ammuta. Right, so there's... I don't know what's happened there, but there's a flight, it's a civilian flight that's landed, it's obviously been with armed personnel on board, and they're going to attack the airbase by looks of it. It doesn't seem, you know, like a real situation like that would occur. Um, yeah, I don't, that seems unrealistic that bit actually, and I'd imagine Finland would respond adequately to something like that. 100% because they didn't look like there was too many soldiers there. Kajaani, lentoasema, useita ilmoituksia. 302 matkalla. Poliisilta on saatu aseellinen virkaapupyyntö Kajaanin lentokentälle. Kentälle on laskeutunut aseistettu joukko, kenttähenkilöstöä on ammuttu. Tehtävään on käsketty Kainuun prikaatin ammattisotilaiden henkilökunnan valmiusosasto ja varusmiesvalmiusyksikkö sekä uuteen jääkärrykmentin erikoisjääkärit. Len Special Jaegers are seen there. Hang on, where, where was that? I'll rewind it back a bit. What was that? Tasto ja varusmiesvalmiusyksikkö sekä uuteen jääkärrykmentin erikoisjääkärit. Yeah, and Special Jaegers from UT Jäger Regiment. Is the, right, so are these Jaegers, is, is that similar to the um, Swedish Jaegers? You know, what, what, what is that? Lennokki, mette ilmaa välittömästi. Selvitä toiminta täällä lentokentän alueella. 
Selvä. Muut, aloitetaan lentokentän eristäminen heti kohteessa. Tässä valmiusosaston johtaja kaikille. Tilanne kuvaa Kajanin lentokentältä. Poliisin havainnon perusteella kentällä on noin joukkueellinen tunnuksettomia sotilaita automaattiaseilla varustettuna. Joukkue on hajautunut terminaalirakennuksen ympäristöön ja sen läheisyyteen. Tehtävä toteuttaa sotilaallisen maanpuolustuksen tehtävänä. Johtovastu Kajanin lentokentällä on siirretty poliisille. Yeah, so the police have handed it over to the defense forces because obviously a platoon level um, attack from offensive forces, you're going to need at least double treble the strength before you'd even consider taking it on just to minimize your own um, casualties, okay? Tehtävä johtaa Kainon prikaatin valmiusosaston johtaja. Vyksin päällikkö tuli paikalle ja erikoisjääkärit on tulossa myöskin tälle alueelle. No tuli patteri asemissa 10 kilsaa tossa suunnassa, lennokki ilmassa ja pääosat alueella. 50. Tehtävä teille. Eristä lentokentän alue ja estä kiitotien käyttö kuorma-autoilla. Vastaa tulen käytöstä eristyskehällä. Kysymyksiä? Ei. Toteuta. This is really cool, guys. I really like the fact that they're, they're giving us a little bit of an insight of how they'd respond um, and their different counterparts. I'm hoping to learn a little bit more about Finland's military because I, I've learned a lot about Sweden's military over the past couple of weeks and it would be interesting to see how you guys compare. All right, I've heard a lot of pros and cons from both sides, um, so I would like to make my own opinion on you guys very soon. And at the moment, it looks pretty cool. It looks pretty organized. The kit looks good. Tarvitaan. Mikäs teillä on tällä hetkellä tilanne? Meillä on tarkka on että lähti suoraan siirtymään asemiin. Pääosat on tässä ja ollaan. Yeah, so they're getting the snipers out, they're getting the probably art, uh, mortars or artillery a couple of kilometers away. I would imagine they would have that. Um, but yeah, definitely get the snipers up there to get um, information relayed back to HQ. That's what they'll be doing and taking out targets if they need to. Ollaan valmiit. Teidän tehtävänne on terminaalirakennuksen ja lennonjohtotornin haltuunotto. Kysymyksiä. Devil 6. Tää on selvä. Tornin tasan täällä kolme henkilöä. Rynnäkkikeväärit kaikilla ja yksi ohjus. Lisäksi tornin sisällä yksi henkilö. Devil 6. I mean, realistically, you've got an invading fighting force, okay? And they've invaded that, that country there, Finland. And I know it's only a simulation, but you would not have a guy just walking around um, that air tower there randomly you know they've just invaded they're going to be on high alert themselves okay because they'd be expecting um a counter-attack and you wouldn't you wouldn't see that um they wouldn't just be bimbling around they'd have their own snipers out okay if there were a um a conventional fighting force they'd have their own snipers out looking out on the land scan the area and stuff so toteuta kaikille kaikille tässä Devil 1. Aloitan alas laskun. Black one, mission high speed flyby in 10 seconds. Oh nice, we got the uh, got the flybys guys. This is gonna this is gonna kick some ass. Leo, boss johto, toteuta harhautus. Neljä. Kolme. Kaksi. Yksi. Toteuta, toteuta. <laughs> so he, that's them two taken out guys. Devil 62, muusta sivu, sinkomies tuhottu, yksi pakeni torniin, yksi punaiselle sivulle. 61, kaksi pudotettu tornin, rakennuksen kaksi valkoisen sivun pohjoisolelle. Now I'm not sure if these are actors or not, they'd probably, I'd, I'd expect them to be military personnel. That's, their skills and drills look pretty good so far, I know they've only shown a few, but they look pretty switched on so far like, and the kit, again, is pretty good. Devil 1, kaiken. Devil 2, sisämenopisteellä. Yeah, these aren't actors, guys. All right, these have got to be military personnel um, who, who are acting as as, as the um, soldiers in this. They've got to be. Ulkoministeriö piti juuri hetki sitten tiedotustilaisuuden. Eduskunta on vahvistanut valmiuslain mukaisten lisätoimivaltuuksien käyttöönoton. 
puolustusvoimat aloittaa joukkojen perustamisen ja valmistautuu tarvittaessa sotilaalliseen maanpuolustukseen. Miina, päällikkö. Miina. Laske sojamiinote 301. That what they were and that white thing is um, a bit of a story for when I was in the Royal Marines. Whenever you were on ship and you were practicing certain things, that's called a flash mask, what they're wearing there, the white thing. And it's um, in case a bomb drops on the ship or something like that and or, or sets on fire, the initial flash, the um, bomb blast flash can burn the skin and everything. And that's what they are. It's an anti-flash mask. And whoever was... Uh, I, I was known for being a little bit angry on ship. I got, I got quite grumpy, so... If you um, had too many outbursts or flashes, as they would say, you'd have to wear that all day. And yeah, I wore that quite a few times, guys, when I was on ship. <laughs> in fact, while we're on that, if you did something similar when you were in the military, let me know. I'd be interested to see if you used that flash mask for the same reason. Maavoimien tilanne. Operaatio Kajaanissa on päättynyt. Haavoittuneita evakuoidaan vielä. Vihollisen hyökkäyksen jatkaminen lentokenttää hyödyntäen on estetty. Mistä tässä hyökkäyksessä oli kyse? Todennäköisin vaihtoehto on se, että tämä on ollut laajemman sotilasoperaation ensimmäinen vaihe. Tämän jälkeen on mahdollista, että tulee lisää sotilaallisia operaatioita. Tällä alueella tai nyt muualla Suomessa. Mitä tällaisella hyökkäyksellä halutaan saada aikaan? Yeah, the ports are definitely going to be an area of strategic um, interest. Airports, ports, all of these places, because airports for the airplanes goes without saying that you got if you knock the logistics off straight away, then you can't um, you can't maneuver people, you can't get resupplies and all of that stuff. So it's the first areas that would be normally um, subject to a potential attack would be those transport and logistic areas, definitely. Joukkueensa hälytys, taistelukosketus. Hätäkeskus. Hangon länsisataman kulunvalvonnasta. Kahta henkilöä on ammuttu. Tekijät valkoisessa Volkkarin pakettiautossa. Charlie, välittömästi komentopaikalle. Valvoma. Tässä tähy. Täällä ajaa rynnäkkövaunuja ulos laivasta. Maavoimat. Merialkaväkikomppania on noussut maihin Hangossa sekä Tektomin alueelle on tehty maahanlasku. Maavoimat on käskenyt lyödä Hangon alue. Here's a question then. I'm not very clued up on my foreign tanks and stuff like that. What type of tank is that? Is it even in service at the moment or is that just for the um, is that just for visual effects and stuff? Do they actually use these tanks real time and if so, what are they guys? Let me know. Olen tunkeutuneen vihollisen tavoitteena Hangon satama. Tehtävän on käsketty Porin prikaatin taisteluosasto, jolle on alistettu mekanisoitu osasto panssariprikaatista sekä kaartin jääkärirykmentin kaupunkijääkäri pataljoona. Maavoimat päättää. Taistelusta hyökkää reittiä karhu Hangon alueelle, jossa lyö kohtaamansa vihollisen tavoitteena Hangon satama. Hangon alueen väestölle on annettu määräys poistua välittömästi alueelta. Yeah, you're gonna, you're gonna definitely get the um, population evacuated. Arguably you would have done it a lot earlier than this any area of strategic interest because right now the the chance of attack would be immediate for this so it might be a bit late for these to even evacuate if you think about it because you don't know where the enemy forces are Pelastuslaitos on aloittanut väestön evakuoinnin Lege fienana slag i so evakuoinnistrupperna från öarna söder om Hange they look like pro they're probably marines, okay, simply because they're amphibious at the moment. So if they are marines, what are the... Okay, can you confirm that with me, guys, in the live feed? I'd, I'd like to know that as well. One fall some road defense and platoon start fiend and utrust at my infantry weapon. Company at two gift, one fall of slow fiend. Papa, Papa, it's Nolla. Kaksi vihollisen kevyttä tankkia itään, pisteestä Foxtrot, Foxtrot, suuntaan 17.00, etäisyys 100. Ykkönen, tuli valmis. Alfa 2, Alfa Kerppi, ilmoituksia tuttuurihlaasemissa. Alfa 2, valmis.
Question then, guys. What weapon system was that? What weapon system was that? Tilanne keskus huomio. Ilmavoimilla torjunta tehtävä hango suunnassa. Kaksi parvea saanut käskyyn torjunta tehtävä. Taistelijohtaja ykkönen, sulle tulee Matrix-parvi. Ja taistelijohtaja kakkonen, sulle tulee Kätti-parvi. Molemmilla hävittäjä osastolla torjunta tehtävää Helsingin länsipuolella olevaan vihollisosastoon. Ja ilmatorjunta hoitaa pääkaupunkiseudun. Matrix 1, Target, Lead Group, Lina 170, Hostal, Two Contacts. Matrix 1. Rooster, Lead Group, Lina 165, Hostal, Two Contacts. Matrix 1. Right, we're going to see a dogfight now, troops. Really looking forward to this. See how you guys uh, fare up in the air. Lead Group, 37,000. Matrix 2, your target, Eastern Contact, Romit. Mitch no targeted Eastern Connor, three six thousand. Mitch one target, Western Connor. Mitch one, Fox three, Eastern Connor. Mitch no, Fox three, Eastern Connor. Mitch one, Splash, Western Connor. Mitch no, Splash, Eastern Connor. Leka, Leka 1. Kärki vaihdettu. Havaita siiveltä. Okay, so it didn't really show the outcome of that unless it's gonna get back to that a bit later on, but... Yeah. Alueella tankkeja, kevyitä tankkeja. Silmä kärjessä, postus 15 alueelle. Josta suojaa oikean sivustan. Kilpi, siirry siellä kärkeen. Kilpi 1, KS1, Sarka 1, Pakko 1. What is that? What is that in front of there? That looks, that looks, that looks absolutely evil. What is that? If you know what that is, drop it in the comment, guys. I would not like to be uh, rammed into by one of those things. Nine. If there's a mine, they probably is going to be getting ambushed. That would be my guess. That's normally the uh, first diversion, and then they're probably is going to get led into um, an overwhelming fighting force. That's what I predict. I might be wrong. That is cool. I've never seen one of those. It looks like it's something out of Terminator. That is awesome. Have we got if we got Private James Ramirez in the chat or Corporal Dunn or anyone? What's the uh, saying for this? What does that sound like, guys? Drop it in the chat. <laughs> What is that? Ah, is, is that a mine clearer? That's what that is, isn't it? Is that something that would obviously churn up the ground a little bit for the mine to explode in front of it so it doesn't wreck the tracks potentially? Is that what it is? A mine clearer? You're on your lead, Kel. KS, Kilpi tukee. Hyökkää Kilve vasemmalta puolelta. Lyö kohtaamasi vihollinen. Tavoite hangarin tasa. Leka 1. Kilpi läpi miinotteesta. Valmis tukemaan auton laidasta. Edessäni tankkeja tuhoan. Leka yksi. Kilpi tukee. Alfa tyyppi, lamautan! Got the artillery in everything now, guys. It's full on attack mode now. Porin jääkäriprikaatin taisteluosasto on edelleen taistelukosketuksessa hangossa. Vihollisen merijalkaväkikomppanian eteneminen on pysäytetty. Maavoimat päättävät. Leka 1, KS1, tavoitteessa. Leka 1. Kilpi, jatka keihään tasalle, torjuntaryhmity. Kilpi 1. This is Alpha 110. Fem fiene infanteri soldater avärjade söderoppivo kis. Over. Tuli komentoja. Viisi kertaa. Ampukaa. So they're getting the artillery fire and the mortars on 
um, on the targets, guys. Maali, ilmatyyny alus. Maali, ilmatyyny alus. Aktiveera CCD. Log flugbana. Log flugbana. Chukutrello. So I think those guys are forward air controllers. That's what I believe they are if they're calling in air support on uh, different enemy targets. A pretty cool job, that as well. If we've got any FACs in the chat, let us know about it, guys. I want to hear your stories. Verivoimat on tuottanut tappiota upottamalla yhden ilmatyyn aluksen. Maakuntakomppania ja kaupunkin jääkärit ovat aloittamassa taistelun Hangon alueella. Jäger Regiment. Got to love the Jägers, guys. Okay, we're taking casualties now. Let's see how they react to this. What's that he's putting his mouth there? It's like it's some form of medicine. Like a morphine based medicine or something. What is that? Vihollinen on tunkeutunut maahamme etelässä, mutta sen kärki on pysäytetty hangon alueella. Vihollisen liike uudessa suunnassa ohjataan sulutteilla sekä tulen käytöllä puolustustaistelun kannalta edullisille alueille ennen vastahyökkäyksen aloittamista. Suomi on sodassa. Tasavallan presidentin puhe alkaa kello. This is pretty cool guys, I'm enjoying this video, I, I still feel like I don't know a lot about Finland and the military though, so I do want to, um, I want a decent documentary to react on guys, just like the Jäger Soldat series, I wouldn't mind a um, Finland based military documentary so we can react through the whole series so at the end of it myself and everyone else can be a little bit more wiser of it, because I feel this one's a great, great example of what they do in reaction to war, but we haven't getting to find out um, the elements of the training of the individuals and all of that, so I'm interested to know a lot more about these guys, but so far off, off this, they look pretty cool guys. If you've made it this um, far in the video, please like the video, please subscribe to it as well, I'd appreciate that. Keskuksen reserviläiset ovat taistelleet sisukkaasti, mutta ylivoimainen vihollinen on pääsemässä murtoon. Alueellisena reservinä ollut taisteluosasto aloittaa vastahyökkäyksen vihollisen lyömiseksi ja murron ehkäisemiseksi. Maavoimat päättää. I mean, I know it's just a, um, a, a, a simulated scenario um, of what they would do, but it's pretty well put together, guys, all right? These, these will probably just be actual soldiers. I can't imagine them using actors for this because the the way they're doing things looks really... Um, it looks pretty real, okay? The skills and drills and stuff. Alueellisena reservinä ollut taisteluosasto on menestyksekkäällä vastahyökkäyksellä lyönyt vihollisen. Tämä 
oli kuvaus siitä, miten Suomi saattaisi joutua sotaan ja miten puolustusvoimat varautuu sotilaallisiin uhkiin. Suomen puolustus perustuu teihin ja meihin kaikkiin asevelvollisiin. Te kouluttaudutte haastaviin tehtäviin. Onnistuminen edellyttää hyvää reservin osaamista ja koko kansan tahtoa puolustaa maata. Me olemme valmistautuneet pahimpaan. Right then, troops. So, just put my head in the middle again, and let's get a bit of a lighter screen behind us, eh? There, yeah, that's a nice. I like that bit. So then, troops. That was really interesting. Again, I'll um, I'll emphasize the fact that although this was a simulation and it was a simulation of how the Finland would react to um, war, they obviously mentioned that they are ready if uh, the worst was to happen, um, and I understand that. Okay. Um, and it was pretty good. I liked some of the things that I saw. It was um, as I would expect from a conventional fighting force such as uh, Finland. However, I, um, I thought it would have given me a lot more information of their military in general, but I'm still um, still eager to, to learn and understand a little bit more, uh, as I'm sure you guys are as well. If you don't mind in the chat dropping a recommendation for me of a documentary similar to that of the Jäger Soldat series, because I thought that was absolutely brilliant guys i loved that series and if we can get an equivalent one for finland i would really really like to react to that because we had 16 17 episodes of the jäger soldats yeah and from the beginning i knew nothing at the end i feel as if i could hold a conversation with the jäger soldat on their training okay because i've learned so much about it and i really enjoyed it as well so if you know any of those i would love to start reacting to those on finland but tomorrow guys we've got another swedish um reaction video for you to look forward to but if you've made it this far and you did enjoy this reaction to um the um i can't even pronounce it but battlefield 2020 of finland then please like the video please subscribe to the channel hitting the notification icon so you get notified of everything that we um every time we go live i'd really appreciate that also guys i'm going to be dropping in the description now on the uh, in fact on the live chat uh, loads of links and those links will all take you to the same place my instagram my twitch my tiktok and most importantly um my well i've already said it the twitch and discord yeah normally after these videos i'm going to be going straight live on the twitch and i'll be playing um different military games different games okay on there for a good few hours after these videos have premiered so last night after we uh, premiered the last ever jaeger soldat um episode we had about 60 people on twitch and we all had a chat it was really really good if you're on there please drop a comment if you enjoyed it because we had such positive feedback i really enjoy talking to you guys so that's a way of me talking and interacting to you guys live okay literally as live as you could get we are chatting with each other on there so instead of me just going live on my phone chatting to you guys i'm playing a few games which most people like to watch anyway and you guys can ask me questions and you can all chat amongst yourselves and it's a really good close-knit community on there so hopefully after this in about five ten minutes of time we'll be able to see you guys on twitch as well happy but other than that troops i really do hope you've enjoyed this one if you've donated to the channel so far Thank you guys, I really do appreciate each and every one of you guys. We had some fantastically generous donations yesterday by some of you wonderful, wonderful individuals. And I can't thank you guys enough for supporting this channel and supporting the growth of it. It really does help the channel to grow. So thank you, thank you, thank you. Special shout out to a few of our moderators, Arc Ninjas, uh, Max Viking, OnePlus Zulu, Samuel, and if I'm forgetting anyone else off there, I apologise. But you guys have been amazing on the channel as well. Thank you guys. I love you all. And until the next time, which is tomorrow, I'll see you later. But see you on Twitch in a few minutes. Peace.